Hello to all Manchester United fans all around the world. Into our daily roundup of the latest news stories and transfer news about our club. Brendan Rodgers' appointment could see Manchester United return to their old traditions. Old Gunnar Solskjaer seems to be clinging on to his job after picking up just two wins out of his last six matches in all competitions. United have won just once in their last eight Premier League games, which has mounted pressure on the Norwegian. Men's sport understand Solskjaer is still on borrowed time as United manager and, although it looks unlikely to turn things around, the club are yet to identify an obvious replacement should they decide to make a change. Can you understand why United haven't made a change? It feels very repetitive. Remember what happened to Jose Mourinho? Well, Solskjaer is three points adrift from the tally the Portuguese manager had before he was sacked in December 2018. As much as I want Solskjaer to succeed and will back him whilst he's still in a job, it feels like the writing is on the wall. Solskjaer has also given debuts to the likes of Anthony Alanga, Brandon Williams, James Garner and Ethan Laird, but there is a problem. Do you know what it is? You can't question his ability to use the youth, but does he use it enough? When you think about it, Greenwood is the only established youngster in the senior squad that's come through the academy under the reign of Solskjaer, but others haven't been given the same amount of minutes to perform. Swedish youngster, Alanga, was sensational during pre-season for the club and even scored on the final day of the last campaign when United beat Wolves at Molina. It's led to some people criticizing Solskjaer over the issue and, if you are to believe reports, one of United's potential candidates to replace him has a history of putting faith in youth. Thank you very much for your time and effort this is all what we have today for Manchester United news please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more updates.